an, just an amazing win. Uh, I think hopefully the turning point of our season, uh, I think a, a game that, that can show us how, how to fight and how to never give up. Uh, I thought Jewel was just simply amazing. I mean, she carried us the entire game. Uh, was phenomenal, poised at the free throw line. Um, I was, you know, we made a ton of mistakes and in so many different areas, and I think we can learn from this and grow from this, but uh, just, just uh, really amazing to come out of here with a win on that game. Um, I never saw it as a one-on-one -on -one battle at all. Um, it's a, it was a team effort. Um, you know, obviously she made some threes um, and she attacked the basket pretty well, but we were worried about what we need to do on de defense and offensively, but it was never a one-on-one -on -one battle. Is there a, something that goes through your mind, though, that, you know, you're obviously in position a lot to get the best shot for your team. Uh, what goes through your mind when you guys do need a play like that? Stay poised. Um, we practice a lot, you know, that's why you practice, you do a lot of repetitions and um, I'm used to having the ball with that kind of pressure coming from, um, you know, previous uh, high school and, and we practice, like I said, we have that, um, we practice late games, everything like that, so um, when I, the pressure's on me, I, I know I can trust my teammates and shooting up, um, making the right decisions, making the right passes and, you know, get a good look. What's it like going through, sorry, what's it like going through a game like this, you know, after a tough loss to UConn and then, you know, going through this? It, it was good for us, you know, we had to play different lineups, which made us uh, work on a lot of things. And like Coach said, we made a lot of mistakes, but we're going to learn from that and get better and, and grow and learn. Coach, what was your thought process? What, what did you folks talk about when you all had to control the 17 2 run early in the second half? You know, we just, we just kept talking about how we needed stops. And we, we were, you know, we switched some, then we, then we didn't switch. We, you know, we're trying to mix it up a little bit defensively, but it's so many people with four fouls that, you know, it was, getting harder uh, with Lindsay Allen in the game, trying to keep her out of foul trouble. She couldn't really guard anybody. Um, offensively, we were turning them all over, um, taking quick shots, uh, you know, really obviously trying to get the ball to Jewel a lot of the time, but I thought we had other opportunities. And, um, you know, I thought, we, I thought Madison Cable had maybe the best game of her career, uh, first career double-double. So, you know, we were, we were trying to obviously look for Jewel, but Jewel was, was very, very unselfish and found some people on the three-point line at key times in the game that really, really made the difference. How did you guys deal with the false pressure? What were you trying to do to break that? You know, I think, I think our problem was not having Lindsay in the game. I, I thought when Lindsay was in the game, we were much better. Uh, when she wasn't in the game, it was harder for us. Obviously, you don't have your point card. You're, you're going to struggle a little bit. I thought... Uh, you know, Michael Johnson came in and gave us some good minutes off the bench, but um, you know that, that we knew that was going to be a struggle. You know, you 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 have a hard time um, playing that at practice because they're very good at it. I mean, they're a very good team. They they are aggressive. They're feisty. They shoot the ball well. I mean, you have to guard everybody. They move without the ball. They run uh, out of the net. Uh, they they got some easy baskets in transition. Got some easy baskets off our turnovers, and, and it felt like we didn't get anything easy.